<laughs> we have some really good stuff for you today. That's right. So let's and go. We got nine let's minutes. Let's go. So, okay. okay. Ready? Yeah. 101, okay. 101 is 101. one of my favorites. I love all church ones. And this is such a beautiful, brand new, just came in last week. Mm -hmm. uh, brand new, beautiful church canvas. It's amazing. Grace church canvas. Mm -hmm. It's Comet Salt 101. Show them the sides, how the color goes around I the sides. I love how it blends yes. all the way around on both sides. All the way in there. Yeah. So it's just really sweet. I like that. Sometimes you'll get a canvas and the edges are white. Yes. I love how this one is. Yes. Like, like I've been to a class before and you'll do it and you're like, do it all the way around. Okay. 101. Love it. Let's go. Up next are the double oven mitts. I love these for a couple reasons. Um, so they're, you want to hold one? Yes, I okay. love to. So these are great for getting stuff out of the oven because they're like double handed so you're not going to burn your little arms. And the thing that I love most about them, okay, so for Thanksgiving, if you've got a buffet, instead of having a whole lot of little individual pot holders, just lay this out on your table and then you can put all of your warm dishes on one. Thing. This step is fantastic it's idea. Like, it's kind of, it's a, we'll call it a casserole runner. How I about that? <laughs> love it <laughs> yes. so yes. much. It's also, so. as I'm feeling it, it's thick. Because sometimes oh, you yeah. get cheap ones. And I'm going to adjust our, our YouTube friends. I'm going to adjust y'all a little bit so you can see what we're doing. So, so um, what does this remind you of? Oh, oh, I'm not yes. Yes. So anyway, you're really going to like these. Love it's it. common sold 102. You're either going to say grateful or you're going to say, come on, come on. Yours, yours was the gobble. Mine was gobble. This was the grateful. grateful. So if yeah, you're watching yeah. on YouTube, we're going fast because we had technical difficulties. We're so sorry. So, okay, so up next, comment sold number 103. This is uh, a sweet tea towel. This is a, um, a newer style. We ha I think we have, we did have some thing, uh, Halloween ones like this. We got some Christmas ones coming. Love the stripe on here. Great and the embroidery and tassels. Tassels, Super cute. tassels for your puppy. So you. We're talking <laughs> about um, we're talking about all things food related yes. today because that's what we talked about on the blog yes. was fall fall flavors. Um, so that's the that's where we're going today. Fall. If you it's haven't read the blog yet, hop on over after we're done. Check that out. Okay, so up next is the kitchen towel set of two. So you're going to get two towels. This is going to be comment sold what number 104. are we on? 104. You're getting both of them for one price. I like these because they're going to wash really well. They're yes, the Turkish they style. Um, so this is a cute tea towel that you can actually use. Yes, Rachel has sold me on Turkish towels. Oh yeah, I love they're them. Amazing. I love them. They dry really well. Um, they're thin. You can use them in your bath, don't you? Yeah, absolutely. It's amazing. They're so good. Okay. Yes, I could also love. see a really pretty uh, embroidery on that. So, so cute. And if you're doing stuff. hostess gifts for later, buy one pack, split it up, give yeah, one to one. They don't need to, to know another. it was a two pack. All right, comments sold okay. 105. Okay, so this is a uh, uh, yeah. <laughs> Joy was Jesus on her face. So I, I am a firm believer in why not make household chores fun. Uh, so we've got these cute little scrubby dish uh, dish rags. Actually, one of y'all asked me to bring these into the store. I think yes. that's the main reason I did. But I love these. They work mm -hmm. really well. It's So this is a dish rag, and it's got like a little padding yes. in here. So it's like an extra scrubby. So you've got this. Wash your dishes. What's the uh, word? It's like sisal uh, and cellulose. And sisal. And and cellulose. Yeah, and cellulose. So, um, love it. Just a cute very, little, And I think it will water. clean very, very well. Okay. This is one of Comment Rachel's sold 106. I know. Things. I bring this on about once a month to tell you guys about it, but it's really like, it it's is. because I love it so much. This keeps me sane. It keeps us from eating fast food every night. And it is a great meal planner. So, it's got a super strong magnet on the back. And I don't like magnets on my refrigerator. But this is an exception. So I, I thought you had my side. Christmas card all year. Um, you can think that. <laughs> <laughs> you can. You don't do a Christmas card. You do a New Year's. I card. I do a New Year's card. Okay. So my New Year's card is up. Yeah. Yeah. Um. So this side is a magnet here, so it will stick. It's really strong. It's going to hold the weight of this, um, on there. And then you've got. Uh, you can't see the other days here, but it's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Share a day, and then you've got your grocery list over here that you can tear off and take to the store with you. It's just, I love it. If you fail to plan, you plan to you fail. You plan to fail. So, so get it. To yeah, get you some. Okay, that Anytime was... I don't use it, we're eating for Yes, that's right, dinner. exactly. Yes. That was 106. Okay, what number are we on? We are on 107, and it is Thankful Placement and Napkin Set. The beauty of this is it's a set. Yes. There's four.
four napkins and there's four, four adorable placemats. I'm gonna pull the placemat out so you can see yes. what it looks like. So this is a new set from Mud Pie. Look at that cute font. Super cute, love this. There's also a Christmas set that will be going with us to Lebanon. Really? So we are offering a plug now for Mistletoe Merchants coming up. What day does that start? It starts on Friday. For Friday, which is setting up for yes. the day. Friday, we're, Thursday we're setting up. It's all day Friday, all day Saturday, and then all day Sunday. There you go. So, um, we and by all day Sunday, we mean till five. five or six. I mean, yes. which feels like all day to me. Woo, I'm telling you what. <laughs> After I've been there That's for a Friday and Thursday, Friday, Saturday, till five is all day. we got to roll our old bones out. That's right. You know? Okay. So, it comes with ah. a... <laughs> What are you saying? Are you trying to be old? No, be like, that's you oh, on Monday, right I know. There. Well, I've already put this on Monday's social post. <laughs> yeah. Uh, we're talking about the stuff. Our skeleton so outside, outside. That's going to be me spring. come Monday. Yeah. So, okay, so these are the napkins that come with the set. Um, super cute. They just came, Brittany just put them out today. Um, and you're going to love the Christmassy ones. Yes. They are super cute. And, and of course, if you're going to do that, you may want to also get some of our napkin rings. We don't have that on here, but that are. would be a really cute no, one. We are on the Give Thanks. Um, oh yes, these. So what's so great about these, and these are comments sold 108. These are disposable. Love it. So they're just so pretty. Look at that. So pretty. Put them on your table. You're done. Get them out of here. It gets no easier than no, that. It, it really doesn't. doesn't. We are here to make and your who life easier. And said the paper can't be fancy? Because I think this is fancy. Oh, it's very I lovely. Love it. Yes, and we always talk about those little sunflowers. They're there to make you happy. Okay, so up next, we're going to be talking about our Cotton Colors dinnerware. So what I love about these, I mean, we're going to show you all of them, and then we'll go back and talk about the individual ones. Hi, Joyce. Hi. <laughs> um, so we love, this is going to, the, the big plate is going to be comment sold number 111. Uh, can you go ahead and click on 111, and we'll go back. We're going to go a little so ahead when and come you back. Buy um, you, you clicked on the item itself, and it opened another screen. So just go back to your other screen and click. Uh, just don't click on the item number. Um, okay, so comment sold number 111 is going to be this dinner plate. It's beautiful. It's a great size. They're heavy, perfect quality. Just love oh, them so much. The it could be your everyday and, wear. Oh, totally. Yes. Absolutely. So I feel like this is every day. And then every season, they come out with different, um, different, uh, salad plates yes. to go on here. So when you're leaving your table set, this is going to be super cute. So yes. the Christmas ones are precious. We've got the little blue and white. There's a lemon that's really cute. The Easter ones might be my favorite with the rabbits. Yes, they are. So love. <laughs> okay, so then comment sold number, uh, where we're we at? Key. So give 109 is going to be the give thanks. Look how beautiful that is. So pretty. And I you love can the totally lines mix with and match these two. Yes. Um, and then comment sold number um, 110 is going to be the turkey. So that's a gold turkey. And they go together. And they're, they go together. Like, so, la, 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 yeah, I think if I were setting these on my table, I would do like every other one and swap it up and do like What's a, the deal with that being? I don't know. So this just was, two different ones? This is the one that they had last year, okay. maybe even the year before. And then this is the new one. The turkey is new for this year. Right. So, I don't know. But I, don't know I how think you that. can very well mix them up. And oh, yeah. Match Definitely so mix and match. You want to set that one over so you can see what that looks like. So look at that. So pretty. Lovely. This is going to be gorgeous on your table. They'd also that. look really well with the uh, placemats and the napkins that Rachel showed Absolutely. earlier. Absolutely. So we're going to move on to 112. We've been talking about plates. What are you going to put on the plates? Oh, oh, wait. I got some good stuff for you. <laughs> yes. Okay. So on the blog today, Joy was talking all about the flavors of fall. So this is the pecan honey mustard. I don't think anything says fall better than pecan and honey mustard. It's just a great, yes. warm, sweet taste. So good on a ham sandwich. You know what I was thinking? What? You know, the Aunt Annie's, the big, huge pretzel. Oh, yeah. That would be, ooh, this would be really good <gasps> on a pretzel. Oh, just mm, wood. Yeah, absolutely. So that's going to be comment sold. Number 112, love us some Terrapin Ridge Farms pecan honey mustard. Okay, so the next one. I think we have beat this one over and over. No, but we sell out every time we get them in. We just got them back in. This, so. this is my field of dreams. If you build it, they will come. I say if you, if they taste it, they will buy. Yes, and that's true like 90% of the time. It is. And then the other day, my average wasn't as good. But anyway. That's why I said 90 instead of 100. <laughs> so this one is comment sold 113. It's the 12 ounce. And here is comment sold 114. It's the three ounce. These, 
How do you eat it? I would say, one, two, three, ready? With, with a, a spoon. spoon. Oh my <laughs> You really don't goodness. even need anything. Um, Betsy was really? telling me today that she puts it in her oatmeal, oh, which yeah. sounds delicious. She loves um, it in her oatmeal. It would be great on a biscuit. So I may have to try some of my oatmeal. And some tea uh, this week. and some toast. Yes. All of these. All I'm of telling the you, the, on Friday, I was like, hey, would you like to try this? And they're like, oh my gosh, get me one right now. And then yes. Natalie's little son was like, mama, this is so I, know. I was like, oh, it was so sweet. It made me so happy. So sweet. So with the honeys, I love honey for this time of year. Joy is grabbing our other honeys that are great for fall. So up next, we've got the sunflower whipped honey. This is delicious. It's just a really light honey taste. And it is the whip, so it's going to be thick and it's going to spread really well. What is whipped honey? It's delicious. It's delicious. I am in love yeah, with whipped so honey. Yeah, so it's like... I'm I mean, I think it's just what it sounds like it is. I'm pretty just sure it's thick. honey that's whipped and yeah. it makes it thick. Don't know so how it's it like it's that. Good. That is comment sold 115. Yes. And then I have the whipped honey with the chocolate. Oh, it's, it's a three delicious. ounce. This is comment sold number 116. We used to be in love with this until the pumpkin spice and yeah and now we might have to have a we might have to do like a taste test like a coke or pepsi thing you know like which one do you which like better favorite. which is your yes, favorite so, absolutely um okay now we're going to move on to the chevron little mug okay so as, moving close and yeah. show so as we're talking about the flavors of fall today how cute is this for your uh if you like pumpkin spice latte, it would be good for that. Your hot cocoa, hot cider. your apple cider. I know I, I would love to have some oh, apple cider right now. Oh my goodness, okay, that be so great? cute. And these are from uh, Cotton Colors, Happy Everything, and uh, Collection. And they also have the this. cute little embellishment bowl. So that's 117. So this is 117. This is 118. Look at the little bowl. People have been very disappointed because they want this little guy. Oh, and like, it's he so is cute. connected. If you want him, you have to get you the have bowl. To get. And then here is like the little spreader. Yes. How adorable are these all together? So and if you didn't want to do the spreader with this, I'm seeing like candy corn in there or fall M&M's if you don't like candy corn. Totally but fall M&M's. I know you don't like, chips. I love candy corn. I do like candy oh, corn. Oh, you don't? Somebody, oh. you do. Somebody in oh, here yes. doesn't like candy corn. Oh, I don't no. remember who it is. Okay. Brittany. Brittany. Brittany does not like candy corn. Okay, so the next one we have is our pumpkin tray and towel set. A bacon. I don't know. I don't, oh, like I totally read it. Uh huh. So today yes. in the blog, we talked about how nothing is better than a great breakfast this time of year. Yes. Um, when it's cool in the morning, like I'm telling you, some bacon, some eggs, biscuits, so good. So you need this little guy for your next bacon party. Yes. Isn't that cute? Yes. I just love it. So it says. Uh, bring, bring it home, home the bacon. The bacon. I say, and don't go bacon my home. <laughs> this is so much so fun. Yes, and breakfast in the fall, and you get some hot pumpkin muffins mm -hmm. and all of that. Or some pumpkin. Pumpkin bread. <laughs> Wait. See what we did there? We transitioned. That's right. <laughs> Let's give them pumpkin to talk about. Right? <laughs> exactly. That's exactly right. And then, oh, this is, I just love how their accessories all have cute little words too. So cute. So and this one comes with a tea towel inside that's going to have a pumpkin bread recipe, recipe on it. And it's got this cute little orange ticking stripe. So pretty. Love and, it. And the other one that you we, you saw, it, the tea towel comes mm -hmm. with that one yes, too. Both. With the bacon. So this one is comment sold. 121. Moving on. Okay, so nothing says fall to me more than like pie. So apple pie, pumpkin pie, fudge pie, <gasps> Rachel's famous fudge pie. Ask Joy about <laughs> eating fudge pie sometime when you come Mom, into the store. Don't listen to her. <laughs> Oh I wasn't gonna share it. Oh gosh, that was no, a bad sound. Um, yes. I wasn't gonna say it on here because <laughs> it's public. But it is. It, it's in a blog. You'll if, have to find it. If you want to know Joy's pumpkin or not pumpkin fudge pie fudge story, pie. you just ask her about That's it. That's right. So it's another one bites the crust. Super cute. And what's the little Love thing it. say? And pies the pies limit. Pies the limit. This is Precious. comment sold one twenty two. And now we're moving on. I think we talked my about place. this before. Uh, this is biscuit. the biscuit. We might have talked about this last week. Yes, but, but it, I want to talk it about it again. Repeating. So we um, we just got these in. So this is the cute biscuit skillet for mud pie. It comes with a little recipe. It comes with a biscuit cutter. Super, super cute. Um, Yvonne came in and got one of these this weekend, and she was talking about how she saw on, on something to bake your biscuits in 
um, cast iron. Really? Um, or anything that has sides on it, really. Yes. Any kind of pan that has sides. And your biscuits are going to be chewier because the really? edges aren't going to get crusty yeah. crust. Yeah, right. Aww. So they're going to be they're gonna be softer. Biscuit. Yummy. This so. is adorable. This is great as a gift paired with paired with our terrapin rich farts which we love the strawberry fig jam so good it yes is, fig and jam fig it, and jam <laughs> i don't know what? jam and bread it's from what is that i don't know what that's from okay okay <laughs> jam, and jam and bread okay okay <laughs> this uh, and if you also, uh, Rachel helped me with the, the difficulty, but it was, um, we have these recipes linked on the blog. Yes, on the blog so this week, there are, are several good recipes it. linked up. Yes, so there is that. We are moving along to the dip bowl with the dip lid. Bowl. You grab that. Okay, this is something else that Joy featured today in the blog. Um, if you don't know, we post a vlog every Tuesday. Um, every always Tuesday. full of inspiration, decorating tips. Today it's full of Food. Full of fun and food. So, um, we've got our little dip bowl here for mud pie. I like this because if you're taking it with you somewhere, it does have a lid. The lid, it's okay, I got it in my hand. Yes. <laughs> um, the lid does not have a seal on it, so you might want to be cautious of that. If I was taking this somewhere, I might wrap a little piece of saran wrap or something around yes. it just to make sure that everything's uh, staying uh, closed. Um, or if you're serving a warm dip, you can use this as a trivet. So, and put it underneath yes. it. So, if you've got like a, a pizza dip or something like that. And then, of oh, course, please. it's mud pie, Another so it comes cute. with a spreader that says, Dippity doo dah. Dippity doo dah. <laughs> that is 125. Yes. We're just gonna be here a little bit longer with you. We hope you'll stick with us. I know it's after five, but since we were a little bit behind, we're just gonna carry okay. on. These are not dips, but these are salts. Okay. Amazing. So I think that there's nothing better than smoky flavors in the fall. So I've been using both of these at home quite a bit. This is the one that I have. What number are we going with first? We are going with 126, which, which is, is the yours. Apple. Oh, mine? Okay. Yours. So the apple and smoked sea salt, this is great. It's a good, it's a great quality sea salt and it has a smoky flavor to it. So I've been putting this on and it, it's stout with the smoky flavor. Like you're going to notice that it's It there. is stout. It is stout. It's stout. in a good way, in a good way. But I've been putting this on my, like, on my roasted vegetables. Yes. Um, really good. I can see this on chicken. I can see it um, on the grill. You could probably do it like on steaks or something. Mm. Um, it has a new York strip recipe on the back, which sounds delicious. Love it. But so, she fully love it. endorses these. Love it. She oh, it's good on broccoli. I know Joy won't agree with that, but on roasted broccoli, real good. Yes. <laughs> but she completely endorses these because also all of the stuff in it is it's clean all clean, clean. ingredients so and we that's love very that. important to us yes this one is so common is, sold 127. and this is the miss memphis. Uh, memphis 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 barbecue <laughs> you're hurting my ears <laughs> the barbecue rubbing seasoning also great good on pork if you're doing um pork sandwiches for like tailgate or something like that this would be a great seasoning to use so yeah love 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 it. we've had some um customers come in and give rave reviews on these. oh yeah yeah i think so right. but that was it was definitely um a reason that you got it was because of all the clean ingredients yes. in it too but yeah and it tastes wonderful so. it's yeah yeah clean and not good we don't want it <laughs> so anyway this one is comment sold 128 so check out these cute napkins love the plaid on this that's or... actually 129 okay. which is the small one my eyes can't <laughs> there we go look at this precious one with the little pumpkins on it love it so that is fun. the cocktail size you're getting 20 napkins in there yes. and then this is the dinner napkin that coordinates you're also going to get 20. look how cute this is oh, so because sweet. the plaid here in this little pumpkin same so plaid Look how we did that there. Love How it. smart we are. So that's 128 and 129. We're coming down to the Last final two. two. Okay, so if you came to the store on Saturday, you got to sample some chocolate out of I our wondered what you put in it. Uh, fondue set. Okay, the only thing in it were those chocolate chips that are up there. So we just put some good quality Ghirardelli chocolate. Have you been eating them? <laughs> yes, she they has. Were taped <laughs> she taped them into their life. You taped them right back up in. <laughs> Oh, I can unwrap this. Oh, I can wrap it. Oh, she thinks she's so, got joy. I was gonna say, well, maybe we'll sample this some on Friday and Saturday yes. here in the store, but we may not enjoy it on no, the chocolate I, first. I only <laughs> ate like three handfuls. So, <laughs> <laughs> I was like, this is a sweet, precious gift for me. She left me chocolate. <laughs> maybe and I'll buy some more. Not only generic, she got me. Oh, there's a bat. Oh. <laughs> Sticking, so they pre 
chaotic but through the day we've had bats fall <laughs> <laughs> the window looks really fun, by the way, so come in and see. As he window. fluttered, that was good. <laughs> so, I can't even talk anymore. If, okay, you, if somebody so, turned off at five, you missed You that. missed that. That's all. I'm sorry. Yeah. Um, yeah. Fun so I was like, she got me Ghirardelli okay, too. So there, I just put some Ghirardelli chocolates in here. There's a little tea light that comes with it. No liquid it. with it. You no just liquid. stuck the chocolate. Just yeah, just the chocolate in here, and I uh, used a plastic spoon to stir it up. That's amazing. And it was so hot that, like, I had to blow the candle out a few times during the day because the chocolate was going to burn if I let it keep going. Things so, that we shouldn't have by myself on Saturday. That's what I'm thinking. Fine. <laughs> Come in. Yay! We're going to have so, a party while she's partying in Lebanon. Yeah. So, there you go. Okay. I love it. Final thing. It really gets hot, so it's going to be good for cheese, too. Cheese, I would probably melt before I put it in here. Yes. And then just use to keep it warm because... Your cheese dip, you want to start it on the stove, really. Yeah, and it gets, so. gets lumpy. Okay, to finalize all of our wonderful fall flavors, you just can't go wrong with a great charcuterie board. Yes, so for fall, we were talking about smoky flavors. When Jay and I were in Michigan last week, we went to the cutest little cheese store. Yes. It was called the Cheese Shanty, and it was in, like, this old <gasps> fishing village thing that they, oh. like, turned into cute shops, and it had, like, it is, that's all that they had was cheese. What's cheese? What's cheese? You don't so, like cheese? It's not your store. That's right. <laughs> so we got some smoked Gouda. It was really Gouda. It was so Gouda. <laughs> it was so like Gouda. Gouda. Um, and so I'm thinking that, some apples, and then in your fondue that we just showed you, it's yes. small, so it'll sit on here. It Melt would. you some uh, caramel. So just get some like of those caramel squares from the craft ones. Open them up, stick them in there, melt it all up. I got, I got a caramel like sauce the other day that okay. almost had the consistency of applesauce or something. Oh, it was so, yeah. so amazing. Okay. But for those of you who are a little challenged like me of kind of knowing what to do, uh -huh. this is perfect. But if you want it to be more fall dessert, you still perfect. I've seen some cute ones on Pinterest with, uh, they put peeps and like fall candies and the Oreos that have the orange filling in them, yes. like all of that super And cute. like the little Reese's mm -hmm. and all of that. And then I've also fun. seen like the ones that are like the skeleton, the skeleton. and it's like his gut. Uh, we're, we're not, not here for that. We're not so. here for that. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. That is it's it. It's been the happiest hour. I'm sorry we talked so fast, but thank you all for sticking around through our technical difficulties. We appreciate you so much. Yes. We love you guys. Thanks for being patient. So glad you're here today and we look forward to seeing you soon. Joy I'm will be in the store all weekend and I'll be in Lebanon. So That's we'll right. see you there. Party Bye guys. Bye-bye. <laughs>